Yeah, what's up, guys? Sean here, aka I'm a flying midget, and we got Beluga playing. Okay, so check it out, dudes. Um, honestly, I am so sorry, but you are about to see so much progress in this game. My bad. My bad. I literally just did a full recording. I did so much work and made this place look so sick. And then I noticed that my microphone wasn't even turned on and I didn't record any audio. But that's okay because we are going to be actually getting the Beluga playing today, which is what I'm really stoked about because, guys, we already got, I mean, literally, look at this. Like, look at this. Look, we got some double-deckers. I got some double-decker planes going in. I'm so mad, so mad that the last kind of, like, video recording I did was basically useless. And I'm so sorry, my dudes. Um, but look, look, look what we did. We got some two large runways. We got a large ATC. We got lots of jet ways for those big old planes to be landing i wish you guys could have seen all that because it was so hype seeing those double deckers land and they make like 80 grand they make us like 80 grand every time they uh, they land and take off also if you guys didn't notice because now i feel like i gotta repeat myself even though you guys didn't see their video but um if you guys notice the planes look a lot better um and there's a new ai system so there should be planes landing and taking off like crazy in just a second maybe things are just so loading in or something like that look at this literally planes going everywhere right now i mean planes look at this running into each other like don't even care i guess we just got really good insurance at this airport all right but anyway so we've got all this going right now let me show you guys kind of some of the new updates got also some new um like decorations and stuff like there should be yeah fire truck right there baggage conveyors like look at that stuff that stuff's wicked cool to me um anyway so we got the Boeing 747. I got a bunch of double jetways in there. I got large runways. I got two of them now. The large ATC tower. Our airport capacity is still solid. So we're going to be getting the Beluga plane today, okay? Um, so that means that we, we've got our cargo. No, we don't have our cargo jet parking. We've got a large runway. We've got a large ATC tower. And we're going to need three warehouse shelves. So... I'm thinking, where should we be housing these warehouse planes, right? Well, what better way than to start our airport to actually come out here than to do our cargo stuff, like, I don't know, right in the middle right here? Like, what if we just did them, like, kind of right in the middle? Would that be something that's good? Or we could do all of our private stuff over here, like, just make this whole area just private planes and kind of continue it like this, and then do all of our cargo stuff over there. So that's what I'm going to do. And then once we flip it to that side, because remember, we're going to have this go all the way to the end, and then all the way over, and then all the way over that way. I think I'm gonna flip them. I'm gonna have our like res like our, our commercial and private planes landing on that corner and our cargo landing on that corner and then again the same with the uh, with the stuff in the middle. This is gonna be all the double decker big big jet planes or big big planes, but we're not quite there yet. Alright, so I think that means I'm gonna make this area over here our cargo area. Now I want it to be basically the exact same way as uh, as this so i'm gonna try my best we're gonna see what ooh, we got more uh, we got more floor as well all right so i'm gonna try to do this now um basically after this runway we got a two gap and then one coming out so one two and then boom like this so i'm only gonna come out to like there for right now is that far enough not quite one more right no no we got it we got it we nailed it nailed it all right so that's good right there so what we could do is we could do like two private jet areas right here and then all the cargo stuff just all in this back area. I'm not really sure how I want to do it exactly. I don't really want a bunch of these little planes. The little planes don't really make us any money. So you don't really need that much of these little kind of like stairways. Because like if they land, they land, you make some money. Eh, okay. We're also making so much money now that we've got um, that. Look at all these planes. Like literally planes just landing and taking off. It's literally insane. I love this game. The developer should honestly take note. He probably already knows. But that makes this game ten times more fun when we've got all these planes landing and taking off. But alright. So we've got this. I could do two more of those little smaller guys. Do I really want to? I mean, I'm going to have basically eight. I'm going to have, yeah, there's eight right. No, there's four right there. Eight. I'm going to have 12. So I'm going to have 12 places for those things to land and take off for having two runways, which I think is pretty solid. I think that's pretty solid. So what I'm going to do is place, yeah, I think what I'm going to do is actually place some of uh, some of these small jetways right here. If I do some small jetways, at least we can get like the those size planes landing, and I'm, I'm good with that. All right, so we're going to need to do it on this line right here. Boom, we got you going in right there. Now, I'm going to have another guy all the way in the end, right? Yeah, okay, so and then another guy right here. Do I have enough money for that? Oh, my gosh, I do. We're making so much money right now. It's so cool. It's so cool. All right, we're going to go ahead and go taxiway, and we're going to go bang, bang, 
Bang, bang, ski, skate. We're going to go bang, bang, ski, skate right there. All right, we still got 40k right now. So we got that area kind of locked down. I'm going to eventually delete those and actually, wait, can I do that right now? I'm going to delete those and actually place some, some oh, no, I definitely not. Delete those, place some small jetways right there, and then that way we've got the smaller planes kind of sticking to that area over there. Which is kind of unfortunate because they can land and take off right here, but they could also just go all the way over there. So we should be good. Should be solid. And the fact that the planes can, like, run through each other makes my life so much easier. That means, like, you don't ever have to worry. Like, look, that, that plane just swallowed the other one. Um, you never have to worry about, like, adding more runways so the planes don't, like, run into each other. I love it. Literally makes the game so much fun. Okay, so we're going to need our cargo jet parking, which is 800k. Really not that much money. The, the big expense is the is the large runways, which we already got two of those, so we're good. So we're going to need $800,000. We're going to need to kind of place it over here. So what I'm going to do first is, actually, no, we should see how big this cargo area thing is and then kind of build around it. It honestly should just be the same. It should be the same, like, dimensions and everything as everything else. All these other things have. Like, the planes have gotten bigger, but the, the jetways have stayed the exact same. So I'm assuming that at the cargo jetway is going to be the same size. So let's just assume that it's the same size. We're going to go ahead and grab... Um, we're going to grab some of these guys. Nope, not some of these guys. We're going to grab some of these guys. And what I'm going to do is one, two, three, four, five. A five-block gap before the next one. So I want the, the, the airport to look the same. So one, two, three, four, five, and then this guy. All right, so we go. So that only causes five Gs. All right, good. So we're good there. Also, I want to check my rating. Am I still 100%? Still 100%. Nice. I like it. I like it. I like it. All right, so now we got to get our cargo stuff somehow figured out in here. We also need, we also need, where are we at? Outside? No. Utilities? Yes. Yeah, so we need three of these, which are 100,000. Okay. So expensive, but really not that expensive. How big are these? They're not that big. Now, I don't know if these should go inside or outside. Um, we could literally just place them like this, just line them up right here. Because, I mean, people wouldn't really be going in and out of here. So we could just line them up one, two, three, and be good, right? One, two, three. We could do one, two, three. Make a little break, break in them. I like it. I like it. One, two, and three. And there's our three warehouse shelves. That's all we need, right? We need three. Where are we at? No, no, not that. Not that. This guy right here. This guy right here. What do you got for me? We need three times warehouse shield shelves, so we're good. I don't know if that's per plane. But at least we'll be good to at least get one plane landing. Now, I am going to need to expand out my taxiway right here. So we might as well do that right now as we're waiting for a little bit of money. So I need to go taxiway right here, right? Yeah, why does that look different over here? For some reason, something looks different. Uh, no, I guess it all looks pretty much the same. Yeah, because this is going to go out to here. Yeah, out to here. And we'll just take it out to the middle right now. Does that look, does that look the same? For some reason, that does not look the same. It's because it's not the same. There's, like, this thing coming in right here. We don't need that, right? Yeah, we don't need that little guy. We could... Oh, you know what? I feel like I just didn't measure correctly. Yeah, because it's definitely not uh, not symmetrical right now. Um, which is fine, I guess, kind of. I don't know. It's kind of driving me nuts, not going to lie. Um, we could do... I mean, if that comes out to there, it's not that big of a deal, but it would make our the middle area kind of awkward. You know, we'll just leave it. I'm just going to try to ignore that. You know what we, sh we could actually do? We could just add in, like, some of these guys and just maybe just call it good, all right? Just call it good. Throw in some trees. Man, the trees and everything so small. It's so itty-bitty. Um, yeah, we could add I could add in, like, a fountain, but no. We're just going to add in some trees right here. Nah, should we? I feel like there's some better things we can add in. No, not seeding. No, none of that stuff. I guess really the only thing is going to be trees. I mean, we could add in, like, some hedges. We could add in, like, some hedges and, like, a little, uh, like, well, check this out. All right, we're going we're gonna to build something. We're going to build something fun. Ready? Ready? So now I want, wait, where's my, oh, I got to keep creating these things. All right, right there, and then one right there, and then one right here, and then we're going to connect all these hedges. Wait, can we? We, we can't even connect the hedges. Wait, can we? Oh, we can. Nice. Okay, we're good. We're going to build ourselves a little, uh, we're going to build ourselves a little fountain right here. It's going to be legit. I feel like for decorating, um, if the developer does watch these videos, I doubt it, but it would be cool if uh, you didn't have to, oh, if you didn't have to, like, keep clicking your your little thingamajig, it just kept placing them until you hit cancel. Oh, that's 40K. But it's 40K, but we could add in, like, a little little, little fountain-y area. I don't know, dude. Should we? Should we? I mean, I feel like that's, like, a huge waste of money. We phone box. Should we just phone box it? Call it a freaking day? Should we, should we just call it a day? Potted hedge. 
We could literally just, I don't know, dudes. We could put just potted plants in here. I don't know why, I don't know why I did that. I should just delete those. Honestly, I should just delete those. You know what? Let's just delete it. I don't even, I, I, don't, even, I don't even like it. I don't even like it. I don't like it. I feel like we're just going to add in tons of trees later on. And it's going to make, uh, it's going to get rid of those kind of like annoying areas. We'll be fine. We'll be fine. All right, we got 600K right now. 600k so we need what 800k so another 200k more it's go time like check it out we literally already got oh wow this thing looks tiny for some reason why does this look so tiny i mean i guess it's the same size but yeah i guess we'll just do a cargo jet thingamajig right there and get some get some uh get some of these guys wait, wait where are we at get some of these guys going and hope that that's really all we need is that really it like seriously wait do i gotta i think i gotta place one do i need to place one right there Dude, that's literally it. All right. Well, I guess we, I guess the cargo shelves works right there, but we don't really need them right there. All right, that works. That's fine. Okay. So we'll make this area all cargo then. I mean, I don't know how big this beluga plane is gonna be. I guess we'll just wait for one to land. But I guess um, once it lands, I don't know. We, I guess we can see if we can land some side by side. I mean, I'm, I'm assuming we can. Like, we can land some of these massive planes. Like, look at this. This tail is blocking this entire runway, but nobody cares. Nobody cares about that. It's literally just it, it's hilarious. Okay. All right. Well, I guess we could just like wait for that to 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 work to to land a, a beluga. Oh my god, we already got one. Yo, beluga plane inbound though. Look at that thing. Holy smokes. Holy freaking smokes, man. Got a screening for mom on that and everything. Wow. Look at that guy. Look at that guy. Holla at your boy. All right. I like wow, that plane is honestly like it's not very long, but it's just fat. It's a fatty cargo plane, man. Wow, that's cool. That is wicked cool. I love how we already got one. I love this new system. This new AI is like amazing. Literally so good. All right, I, I didn't even see how much we make out of that beluga plane. I'm hoping it's a lot. Honestly, now that we got beluga planes, like, yeah, all we got to do really is expand this area out right here and then just start taking the whole airport all the way around. And then we just got a freaking massive huge airport that's just like producing some big old bucks look at that thing look at that thing like, i'm just getting so many screenings up i love the way it looks i honestly love the way it looks it literally looks like a beluga whale wow i love how it's also deciding to go all the way over to this runway but you know what it's fine it's fine because planes can just run into each other these days look at how many planes we got i just love seeing this runway just absolutely freaking packed dude i love it. we can literally already almost get another cargo plane make oh wait wait how much is that how much is that plane gonna make me Ready, and she's she's in the air, boys. She's in the air. What do we got? What do we got? What do we got? 90K? Honestly, only 10K more than the other one, but still cool. Still 10K more and really doesn't require that much more, so I'm, I'm digging it. I'm digging it. All right, so then I guess we just get more cargo jet parkings because I, I feel like we're not going to need to create three racks for every single, like, one that we have. I feel like that's just, that's just dumb. We wouldn't need that. So now I'm guessing we just load up this whole area with cargo. Just cargo, 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 cargo. Like, two right there, two right there, two right here, two right there, one right there, two right... Like, same thing as over there. Just all cargo planes. And literally just just rake it in. Rake it in. We're going to be literally crushing it. And then I'm thinking... I'm thinking after we after we finish these that area right there and that area over there, I'm thinking we then expand the airport all the way around. And then once it's expanded all the way around, we can, like, decide what other runways we want to actually put in here and make it look good. And then we'll be solid. We'll literally be so like, look, we can already get another one of these guys right now. Oh, my goodness. Like, let's go. Let's go. Like, I'll just place one guy right here. Bam. Dude, like, let's go. Literally making so much money now and just absolutely cru- Oh. Didn't mean to do that. Didn't mean to do that. Oh, we're good. We're oh, I didn't have enough money anyway, so we're good. All right, 10K. There we go. So now we got two beluga spots for these bad boys. Oh, man. I love it. I want more of those things to land. They just look cool. Dude, our airport just looks cool. I love the colors on the planes now. Honestly, I love it. I love it. I love it. It's too good. It's too good. All right, dudes. Well, I mean, I guess that's the video for today. Hopefully, my audio actually recorded this time so I can get this video up for you guys. But... Um, yeah, dude, this is Roman Call Video for you. I hope you guys did enjoy it. If you guys are enjoying this series or you like that beluga, for, I keep wanting to sing well. If you like that beluga plane, comment down below. Beluga, baby. Beluga, beluga, beluga. But, anyways, dude, that is Roman Call Video. Smash the like if you enjoyed it. If you guys want to see more itty bitty airport videos, you already know what to do, guys. But until next time, if you haven't already, make sure you be fly and subscribe. Okay. okay. Yeah. I'm a fly. Yeah. It's a creepy hit, it's been a killing with the rhythm, spilling up the rhythm, chilling about the bigger killing, feeling always building, about to stack it to the ceiling. Uh, haters over there, we're not aware of you. Rapping with my boy Shawnee, a character. Rep the red, white, and blue, America.